men are seniors at the University of Rochester. They are also from separate suburbs in Chicago. Amanda Shivari went to the school to learn more and joins us live. Amanda, what else can you tell us about the victims tonight? Well, Jenna and Scott, we've learned that both play on the University of Rochester's football team. And everyone who I spoke to this afternoon who knows both the men say they are smart, athletic, and very active members of the greater Rochester community. It's scary. It, it's absolutely frightening. James McCauley is with Camp Good Days and Special Times. He says Ani Okiki Iwo often volunteers his time here with his twin brother and classmates. For them to come and then with a no-nonsense approach to, to come and be very serious about the things we needed them to do and then to be just very diligent about getting it done just speaks volumes about the type of person that they are, the type of character that they have. Iwo and Nicholas, or Nico Kalias, are both members of the Delta Kappa Epsilon fraternity at U of R. Their frat brothers did not want to comment on camera but told me they are shaken by the kidnapping of their friends. Both victims also play on the school's football team. Nico, a defensive lineman, and Ani, a defensive back. This afternoon, I spoke with the former U of R assistant football coach who knew both of the men. Nico, he says, was always trying to entertain. Just always happy and, um, you know, would be a jokester at times, um, but was just always a positive kid. Um, also, extremely talented piano player. And Ani, a young man who his former coach says is going places. Always had a smile on his face, um, extremely friendly, would, would come into our office all the time, even if not just to talk about football, but just to talk about life and um, what's going on with him. Also extremely bright. And friends of the victims tell me they are both right now at Strong Memorial Hospital recovering from their injuries with their families by their side. Reporting live from the University of Rochester, Amanda Shavari, News 10 NBC. So very scary. Amanda Shavari, thank you for that report. And